Hi, Adrian. We've got a lot of blended families out there um, where both spouses have children from previous relationships. And sometimes those relationships don't last. So what do we actually do to prevent any mistakes that could happen? How do we protect those clients? Well, I think, um, Natalia, getting good advice from the start is imperative. Um, being fully informed and making sure that you go into this uh, on the same page, preferably. Um, so what that means also is, uh, you know, are we, are we keeping what we've got separate? Um, are we being full and frank about... Uh, what we earn and what we have, or um, aren't we? Um, so talk about money because that's what happens. We don't like talking about money. And um, when we don't communicate, this is where all of those hidden agendas potentially happen. And uh, particularly when one party is more involved in uh, their financial affairs and the other party does not really like spending time on really learning what to do with their finances. Yeah, so typically, and I'm not being totally um, gender biased here, but typically a lot of our female clients don't have a really good understanding of what um, uh, their, their partner earns or, or what they have, for example. Um, but second time around, if you're going into it, you need to have those conversations yeah. and you need to protect each other's assets, I think, before you go into it. Yeah, absolutely. That sounds great. Thank you. Thank you, Natalia.